Hey everybody, welcome back. So we're going to be trying to install Windows 7 on this classic Dell Latitude laptop. I paid like $80 for this machine, and it, it was a snazzy machine. It looks like it came with Windows 8 at one point, but it doesn't accept the Windows 10 license on it, so I'm like, ah, all right. It's got, I think it's got an i5 or i7 processor inside of it. It did have 16 gigabytes of RAM at the time, but I swapped that out and put it in a uh, different machine. Now it's only got... It might have eight gigs. I'm gonna try to go with my A data hard drive. Now you may have seen me put this in a different machine. Well, we were having issues with it entering sleep mode, but since I'll be using Windows 7, let's see if we give it a try. And since this is an older machine, maybe it'll talk to it properly. I mean, it probably won't. I don't know if 120 gigabytes is gonna get me far. So if I do end up changing my mind, I'll put a, like a, a just an HDD inside of it and just doing it that way, but you never know. So I'm gonna make that decision and we'll see what we're gonna do. I got the A data SSD and I decided to go with that one. I'm really hoping we don't have issues with um, it coming out of sleep mode. That was like one thing I always had an issue with is that whenever the computer would go into sleep mode, it wouldn't go into sleep mode, it would lock up or it wouldn't wake up out of sleep mode. Not really sure why that is with these. You really never know, but kind of curious to see what it'll do when we install Windows 7. All right, here it is, all Dusty McGee over here. Yeah, it looks, it looks really good so far. I'm uh, I'm curious because you see the Windows 10 loss. It is the Latitude uh, E5530. Um, I may have recently charged this battery on this as I try to charge them once every now and then, but I don't know if it's got any power now. It does. Okay, it shut down really quick. We don't want to hurt the battery anymore, but the battery does have power. Um, so I'm, I actually found this thrift shop power supply. I'm going to check the voltage really quick. But I'm, oh. It's coming on. What's it doing? We have blinking bad battery. Yeah, you can turn off. I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna pop in our thumb drive. I think it'll read it. It might not. Depends on what it does. I don't know if I need to press a boot key or not. Okay, that's the hard drive. There used to be a different operating system on there. So let me see, Was it, is it F8 maybe? Something like that. F12. Yeah, USB storage device. Sweet. All right, load Windows. Load Windows 7. Love this screen. Love it so much. Not much space, but should be enough. We're going to go ahead and install, install Windows. Yeah, this hard drive is pretty fast, you know, for it. I know it's, it's pretty good, but again, with that whole sleep issue, if it has it again, I'm just going to put an HDD in here. So we'll see what happens, right? All right, so I just left it. It uh, went to sleep at some point, or it shut down, I don't know. Um, I think Windows 7 is installed on the A data, so on this Dell. So I'm kind of curious to see what it does. Oh, yeah, resuming Windows, of course. All right, Eastern time, there we go. We'll see where this goes. All right, look at this. Windows is running, the battery is charged. Look at this super excited about it glad that it's working yeah definitely kind of want to see i know it's not there's no graphics yeah i can't test the graphics yet I, there's no graphics driver i want to see device manager though and see what is not installed all right yeah we got a couple things here let's see disk drives okay so it does show the a data Yep, the driver is from 2006 for some reason. I don't know why, but I can't find it. Like, I can't find the, like, updated driver for it for some reason. Yeah, they're all going to be until we get some updates in it. But, yeah, it looks, <clears throat> looks like it is working, though. Happy about that. Well, everybody, it looks like that this Dell is working. I definitely want to do a couple other interesting videos with this. I've got another one 
I'm going to be bringing out here soon. Pretty excited to try it out and see if it's going to work in my favor. Well, everyone, I want to say thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And as always, we'll see you in the next one.